Hey guys, it's Jalen. Welcome or welcome back. I'm here today to share with you my update for Child of the 80s. This is a Fantastic Ladies Club project. It was created by me and it's all about the 80s. <laughs> Surprise! We roll in eight prompts at a time. It's roulette style. There are 80 prompts. So as an FYI, I filmed this, I filmed last month's update before I left for Spain and I put it on my computer and then my computer, I left my computer on the plane and I haven't gotten it back. Now I came back and I was like, where is that content? I cannot find it anywhere. I think there are two or there were two or three videos I had filmed that I couldn't find the contents for. And it dawned on me that I am missing an SD card. So I have like this avert, like one of these that connects to my computer or iPad. It works for both. The old, this is a, a replacement because I cannot find the one that I had was using prior to leaving. It's somewhere in this house. It's just gone. I don't know where it is. And it has the SD card with that content inserted in it. So I can't find it. I figured I might as well just skip that update because it's a month old. So I'm going to share with you what I rolled in last month because I rolled in a bunch of stuff. And I forgot to mention, I didn't even show you what I finished. I don't have it. Well, maybe I can grab it. I can grab it. I may have moved because I have to go get some things. But let me share with you the items that I was able to roll out. I think there were a total of four items that rolled out last month. So the first is for the prompt, Let's Get Physical by Olivia, Olivia Newton-John, an item that makes you feel sexy or that is sex themed. Dirty, dirty. So I rolled in this NARS Velvet Matte Lip Pencil in Do Me Baby. And I wanted to use this 10 times. I did hit that goal. This is really pretty. It's really not for this time of the year, but for me at least, I feel like it's more of a fall shade, but it's gorgeous. So I hit my uses on this. The next prompt was, oh my God, a favorite item or an item that shocks you. So I rolled in the Auric Glow Lust Radiant Luminizer in Morganite. So it's this one here. And I wanted to use this 30 times. I had 18 uses the last time I updated this project and I hit my 30 use goal. This is so pretty. I love this so much. It's very light for me right now, but there's the shade. It's gorgeous. So hit my goal on that. Duh, that's what we're going over. The next prompt I finished a product for was take a chill pill. Something that makes you relax or is pampering. So I rolled in a Scentsy Soak in the shade and scent not shade scent blue grotto the scent notes for this are tropical notes citrus and lush botanicals so uh, this bag was well i don't think it was full whenever i rolled it in i have i have these or store these in a mason jar in my bathroom and i think i was i had enough left for like three foot baths so i finished this up i'm so happy to roll one of these out this has two pounds or 0.91 kilograms so yeah, finished, yay. The last prompt I finished a product for is totally tubular. A product in a tube, and that is that prompt is credited to Deb. So I rolled in this Scentsy Blue Agave and Melon Cream Shave Soap. And I used this while I was traveling. It was lovely, I really enjoyed it. It smelled nice. It was a, gr it's a, it was a great product for shaving, so. I am happy to have rolled this out, but it, it was lovely. I would totally buy it again. Buy this product again, probably in a different scent though, but I did enjoy it. Those were the four items I rolled out. And let me share with you the products I was still working on. So for the prompt, We Are the World, USA for Africa, a universal product that anyone can use. And this was credited to Stephanie at Fupans. So I rolled in a lip balm. This is by Laneige. It's the Lip Sleeping Mask in Vanilla. Now I have since made progress since I last updated this project. Well, since I filmed in beginning of July, I've used a lot of this. <laughs> But since June's update, there's a lot of progress here. So 
that's where I am. And it kind of looks like there's more in the jar this way, but I am getting really close. You can see I have pan, jar pan there. So yeah, I don't know if I'll have this done by the next update, but definitely by the following. So I'm thinking October, sometime in October, hopefully. Beginning of October. <laughs> The next prompt is Steel Magnolias, a floral themed item. So I rolled in this Cora's Wild Rose Advanced Brightening Sleeping Facial. I want to finish this. I really don't like this. Well, yeah, the few times I've used it, I have not liked it. It smells interesting. I don't like it. I think I'm going to get rid of it. I don't think I'm going to declutter this. I don't, I don't like it. I cannot stand the way this smells. I usually don't do that, but I cannot stand it. Uh-uh. I thought about it during the last update, and I just, I, ca I cannot get past the smell. I don't know what it is about that product. So I think I'm going to pick another floral-themed item. I'll have to go looking. So the next prompt I was working on is ET, a unique product. So I rolled in this JD Glow Cosmetics Liquid Glitter Tube in the shade Dazzle. I don't think I shared the shade name when I brought this in originally. I do want to use this 10 times. I'm up to four. So actually five. I used it just now on my, like the very inner portion of my eye. I don't even think you can tell that I applied it. But I was like, let me just get a use and spruce up my eye look. I don't think you can tell. But because just because the Cleona eyeshadow I'm wearing or the MAC eyeshadow I'm wearing is very glittery, but there is the product. So I'm up to five uses on this, so five to go. The next prompt I was working on is Shrinky Dinks, a mini or deluxe sized item, not a sample. <laughs> I rolled in this Buxom full on lip polish in the shade Dolly. Now, I, this is a teeny tiny little mini, teeny tiny. I think I'm down to like here on this. So I do want to finish this. I still have a little bit to go, of course, because I, I just, I have, I did forgot to let this settle, but I'm pretty sure I'm down to about here. So I still have a while to go. The last time I was working on is Dynasty, a product that makes you feel glamorous. So I rolled in a fancy dancy foundation. This is by La Mer. It's the soft fluid long wear foundation in the shade natural 12. So here we go. I want to use, I pulled this in to use 20 times. Last time I updated this, I had used it once. I actually, yeah. So when I, when I, I should say that I rolled this product in June, I brought it into my June project when I updated in July, which that content is now missing, I had one use, but I have since used it a ton. So I'm up to 11 uses on this. I did take this foundation with me to Spain. So that's how I've got so many uses. I didn't wear makeup every single day in Spain, but I would say like five days. And then I've used it several days since then, of course. So anyway, yep, yeah, I've got 11 uses on this and nine to go. When I updated this in July, I had rolled in three new prompts. So let me share with you what those were and what I rolled in. I rolled Milli Vanilli, a product that isn't what you thought it was. You know, where they did the MT Music Awards when it just skipped over and over and over again. That was sad. Anyway, this prompt is credited to Marissa Bernal. So I rolled in for a product that isn't what you thought it was. I rolled in a, this Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in Dulce de Leche. And I rolled this in because this bronzer surprised me. When I used it, I think I used it like for a 10 use goal or something. I was really surprised at how lovely it was for being such a, an inexpensive palette. And I, you can tell I've used the white shade, the cream shade, but there's the bronzer there. So I rolled this in to hit pan. <laughs> it is going to be the only bronzer I work on for the immediate future. I think I have rolled out all the other bronzers I was working on. That may be a spoiler. So yeah, I want to hit pan in this. I've had this a long time. It's like repeat out of for all the products that I'm working on. I've had this a long time. 
The next prompt I rolled was Air Jordans, a, a highly sought after item. And that was credited to Deb as well. So I rolled in a highlighter from MAC. This is from a holiday collection. The shade is Whisper of Guilt. Now this is gorgeous. This, oh my gosh. And with my tan skin, it's beautiful. I am wearing it today. It's lovely, lovely, beautiful. So I rolled this in to use 10 times and I need to look at my book because I can't remember how many times I've used it. So far I've used it four times. So I have six uses to go. So I have six uses to go. And the last item I rolled in was I'm Strawberry Shortcake, a product that smells fruity or is fruit themed. So I rolled in this Ciate Watermelon Burst Setting Spray for watermelon. And I do want to eventually finish this now. I am all the way up here. I've used this a couple of times. I just used it a little bit ago on my face as a refreshing spray. It's really nice. I'm also working on this Smashbox setting or the primer water and uh, I've, I've got a ways to go on this one as well. So I think that one's going to be a bit slow going, but hopefully I can get some good use on it in the next couple of months. So those were all of the items I was working on. I don't have anything that I can roll out, but let me go ahead and find a replacement for this because ugh, no. So I need something floral themed. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go ahead and roll in another product or another prompt, I should say, just because. Because I want to. So let me, I have my, I have all of the prompts in Tiny Decisions on my phone. So here we go. See what we get. Breakfast Club. What's your secret talent? A product that covers or conceals. Okay, found my items. So to replace this Cora's product for Steel Magnolias, I'm rolling in a Body Mist by Rituals. It's Tulip in Japanese Yuzu. Now this is pretty light in scent. So I'm thinking I may tr probably use this as a like pillow mist or something like that because it's very, very light. This has 20 mils in here. So I cannot see through this container, but my goal is to finish this. And for the prompt that I rolled in, which is Breakfast Club, What's Your Secret Talent? A product that covers or conceals. And that was credited to Melinda C. I am rolling in my Smashbox Color Correcting Stick. And this is the last one of these I have. I had a sec another one of these that was a full size and I finished it last year. So I'm working on this one now. And it's great for concealing whenever I'm tan. Let me just blend this out so you can see there. It's pretty close to what I'm, what my skin tone is now. I don't know how long I can use this for, so I'm gonna use this 30 times, at least for this project. I'll probably use it longer. I pretty much use this every time I do my makeup. Let's see, this is August, yeah. Let's do 30 days, because I don't know how much longer. I mean, I think I'll be still dark in a month and I'll still need this versus my Becca corrector, but I don't wanna, cause it's all based on what my skin tone looks like. So we're just gonna put this in for 30, 30 uses. So in terms of things that I can finish by the next update, I will definitely have, I think I will definitely have the La Mer foundation rolled out. I think I'll have my 20 uses on this. I just have nine to go and I'm hoping I'll have my uses on Whisper of Guilt completed because I think I have, what, six left on this if I wrote it down right. I may have not. But I think those are the two that I will have completed. So yeah, that is going to be everything for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you're doing well and staying safe. Please hit that subscribe button and I'll see you all next time. Bye. Not on the bed, but he's here. This is Tropical Notes of Citrus. No. Hmm. This is Tropical Notes.
And the last product, or now, let me show you. So the next prompt is ET, a unique product. So I rolled in my, where is it? Oh, it's right fucking in front of me. Wow. So I rolled in this, du no, not Duxum. And the last item I had, wow, this is a hot mess video. Okay, bye.